there should be a code. We talk about being on code. That should be code number one. Code number one is not to shoot up a Juneteenth event and shooting up black people at a Juneteenth event. Why that's not the code? We talk about always being on code. That should be the code. And, I, and, and I'm going to be real with you. It feels like gang culture is on top of black culture or above black culture. It feels like gang culture is now above black culture. And gang culture could, I guess, absorb black culture. And black culture is now the, uh, 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 the slave to the gang culture. And the slave is the black culture and the master is the the gang culture and we allow gang culture to engulf black culture and where that black culture can't even speak on gang culture you feel me we can't even speak on gang culture we have gang activities where somebody shoot up a juneteenth event and everybody's silent but y'all can't speak on it black on independent media black uh youtubers black content creators black uh social justice warriors y'all can't speak on this y'all have all these platforms and all these podcasts y'all can't speak on a black woman losing her life why because gang culture engulf black culture gang culture is above it y'all gotta be quiet y'all have to be quiet about gang culture gang culture is more of an impact in black culture to black culture than this goofy ass cop shooting up black people Gang culture is more a problem to black culture than some goofy ass white man calling the black person the N-word. What more of a black issue that needed to be spoken about than black people getting shot and killed at a Juneteenth event by black people? The government acknowledged the end of slavery and they made Juneteenth a federal holiday. This year, two black women died by the hands of a young black crash dummy, 17 year old, um, shooting at his quote unquote ops. And I would make the argument that he probably did not hit none of his ops because he's shooting that recklessly and he shot 14 people and killed two. But y'all will use that to gear people up and rile people up about issues that is not problematic as gang culture in the black community, as problematic as gang culture or crash dummies shooting up Juneteenth events. We need to start talking about these things we need to start addressing these things because we're allowing the crash dummies to ruin our fun i spoke about this and there was somebody in my comments and she said i would not even go to black events no more because i understand what could happen how in the world did we get to the level where a black person say i'm not going to black events no more because i understand what happened how is it to where my wife and I went to a black event and on a drive home, we was like, damn, ain't nothing happened. How is that our normal expectation of going to events when it's something that's black and it's black led that we're expecting some crash dummy to fuck it up? There should be a code. Where's that code? There is no code because nobody's speaking on it. That is a problematic issue. There is no code because nobody's speaking on it. Not him, not her. Not this channel, not that channel, not that network, not this network. And y'all still silent as a church mouse. Preachers ain't talking about this either. Speaking of church mouses, they not speaking on this. They have to tiptoe around things like this. But let it be um, some altercation in the white dude killed a black dude. Oh, they all on it. There's a five part documentary on Netflix coming out. If something like that happened, but there's a black crash dummy shoot up a juneteenth event killing two black women shooting 14 people at a juneteenth event y'all silent the reason why i'm so passionate about this man because discussing these issues is crucial it's crucial because how crash dummies don't know shooting at a juneteenth event should be off limits how is that not a thing that they don't know how is shooting at a juneteenth event you you how somebody get green lit at a June? It's certain events, it's certain things that should not be areas or locations of violence. There should be some type of quorum of like, all right, let's just chill. This is a Juneteenth event. This is bigger than us. If we got a problem with somebody, we could sell, settle that problem somewhere else as opposed to a Juneteenth event. Thank you for watching. This is a small clip of the Broken Traditions podcast. 
if you want to see the full episode or listen to the full episode, you can watch it on YouTube or you can listen to it on any audio podcast platform such as iHeartRadio, Spotify, and Apple Podcasts. Thank you.